why there is hesitation for bariatric surgery? Let's talk about this. I am Dr. Sridhar Ravi, surgical gastroenterologist, Kaveri Hospital, Electronic City, Bangalore. We often get patients who are super obese or morbidly obese. What do you mean by that? These patients are 30 kilos more than their ideal weight. If they are about 5 feet, which is about 150 centimeters, their ideal weight should be around 50 kilos, which means 150 minus 100. Anybody more than 80 kilos in these patients are, will, will term as a morbidly obese patient. These kind of patients. Or weight loss for them would be very difficult on their own, even if they change their lifestyle or food habits or go for an alternative therapy also. These are the patients who have to come for obesity. So these patients come to us and saying that, doctor, I'm being overweight. I have got little difficulty in walking or a little difficulty in breathing. I'll wait for some more time. So my question for them is, in the last few years, if you've not had the motivation to lose weight, what gives you the traditional motivation to lose weight later? So for these patients, because they need a strong motivation and they need to be determined and they have to be persistent and the supporting system, whether it is a family or workplace, they need to support these people very much. And we prefer the patients who have failed in these things, who have not, who have tried their diet uh, changes or people have gone for alternative therapy or there is waxing and waning. They've been losing weight, gaining weight, losing weight, gaining weight, which means they have exhausted all their medical conservative therapies for weight loss. Because these people are more focused and uh, they're, they've come ready for the surgery. So my question to the patients is, who refuse surgery is, we are not talking about today, we are talking about 10 years or 20 years later when you start becoming a little older and a few medical problems will come and you have lost this precious time of socializing and feeling normal and enjoying your life. So it's important that we remain fit for a longer period of time and as early as possible. And bariatric surgery has got a very low complication risk and death risk also. Out of 1,000 people, there's hardly one or two people who really go into some serious problems there. World over, every bariatric surgery, there is definite weight loss. De depending upon the complaints, on how we continues to have a consultation with the doctor or changes in their food habits and lifestyles and whatever uh, we suggest they follow, the weight loss is that much faster and that much longer. So I would suggest all my obese patients to undergo the bariatric surgery.